Thousands of auto workers in North Texas preparing to walk off the job as soon as next week. Yeah, Fox Force Hannah Bata live this morning at a plant in Arlington that could shut down if there's a strike. Good morning. Good morning, Brandon and Lauren. Yeah, we're live outside the GM assembly plant in Arlington. This plant makes all of the company's full-sized SUVs, and more than 5,000 of the workers here are UAW members. Some of the union's demands include a 46% pay increase, a four-day work week at full-time pay, and restoration of traditional pensions. The three largest U.S. automakers, GM, Ford, and Stellantis, formerly known as Chrysler, have largely rejected those demands. It's a lot of work. It takes, it works on our body, it, it works on our families. We make a lot of sacrifices yeah. for the company. So we, uh, we just want our fair pay. We've received numerous presidential demands with significant costs attached that would threaten our ability to maintain our manufacturing momentum. Well, the strike is expected to commence if a new contract with the big three automakers is not reached by September 14th. The last time the union went on strike was back in 2019. That time, it lasted six weeks. Reporting live in Arlington, I'm Hannah Bata for Good Day.